זה. One hour of pleasure in the next life will be equal to more than all this life in this earth. What does it mean? Take all the people who lived here from the time of the creation until today, thousands of years. Multiply by millions and billions of people that lived here and still alive here. Take and gather together all the pleasures they ever had. Take all their money, women, sport, massages, vacation, air condition, fancy cars, jet ski, I don't know what, whatever you want. Any hobby you can think of, delicious food, uh, movies, comedies, relations, everything combined of all the people and their entire 78 years of life, every day's pleasure accumulate everything in one huge mountain of pleasure. Food, money, sports, fame, music, glory, clothing, jewelry, you name it. Add everything in one huge pile of trillions of people combined. Multiply all of it together, times, seven years of a life of all the people together will not be equal to one hour of the reward of one religious Jew in the next life. And what are we going to lose it for? For our stupidity. You should do what's straight and correct in the eyes of your God, not your eyes. According to your eyes, to take drugs, drugs is good. According to your eyes, to be a gambler is good. According to your eyes, all day sit and watch TV is good. According to your eyes, to sleep in bed all life is good. Everyone has a different good. Everyone defines good in a different way. If every person would give a speech about what he thinks is correct to do, then why Adolf Hitler is wicked? Why? That's his opinion, that you have to exterminate all the Jews from the world. That's his decent and good, according to his opinion. Come Mustafa, he has also his own good. Come Yitzchak, he has his opinion. Come the American guys that like baseball, for him that's the life. Everyone has a different truth. Everyone has a different good. We are not capable of deciding what's the right thing and what not. We are the creation. The only one can define what's good is the creator of good. The one who made up that expression. The one who decides good and bad is the only one can decide what's really good. Because Hitler thought to kill innocent baby just because their mother is Jewish is good. Go and prove to him that it's wrong. Without God you don't have any proof. You don't have any proof. The Jews want to get rid of the terrorists. The terrorist wants to get rid of the Jews. Everyone has a different truth. Go and prove that it's good to get married. The people who are against marriage, they're going to show you that there are so many bitter marriages. There's no way to prove, nothing. Are you allowed to decide how, what is the right way? No, your creator already told you what's the right way. The only way to maintain civilized life with laws and dignity is by following the laws of the creator. You don't have a creator, you have nothing in your life.